the moral and missing thread. All right. Welcome to or welcome back to the channel, whatever the case may be for you. Uh, if you are new here, uh, welcome. And uh, go ahead, before you think about it or do anything else, hit the subscribe button and we can get everything started and you can settle in and become part of the community. It's awesome. And joining me today, very special guest again, who it's always a pleasure to have on here, Morgan Hamburger. It's been a while. Feels like it's yeah, been a while. It's, a, it's been a little minute. Well, um, January is like the longest month of the year. So Is it? For me, it is. Oh, yeah. It was. Uh, it's been a. It's been a rough month. It's been. It's been. A, mm. I'm not even gonna get into what January's been like. Fuck January. Um. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, uh, we're gonna we're gonna do something. We're gonna do something exciting today. Something a little different. Uh, we're gonna change the tempo, change the genre. We're gonna uh, we're gonna get into some Lana Del Rey. Uh, you uh, just recently became familiarized with Miss Del Rey, right? Uh, yes. Um, you introduced me to her. I love. She's beautiful. And she has a very nice voice. So I'll tell you. I'll tell you a fun fact about Lana Del Rey. Uh, you love Miss Billie Eilish, right? Yes, I do. You know how much I love her. Okay, so Lana Del Rey. Like I'm in love with Billie Eilish. <laughs> yeah, let's but, go ahead. <laughs> Lana, Billie has said in a couple of interviews that like Lana is one of her biggest influences. Okay, I can so, see that. Yeah. Well, this is uh, she put out Lana put out a new video. Um, semi recently it's been a week or two um it's called kim trails over country clubs and i have been dying to see this but i was waiting because i wanted to react to it rather than just watch it um so now uh that i have you here um i'm gonna do that we're gonna do that it's gonna be a fun voyage a fun journey that we're gonna do together with lana del rey are you ready for this I am. I already love the name of the song. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't, I don't know what to think. I just, I, I'm ready for it. That's all, that's all I know is I'm ready for it. So here we go. This is Lana Del Rey, Kim Trails Over the Country Club. <laughs> She's so beautiful. Oh, pause it right there. Yeah, I'm pausing it. Uh, so that mask that she just had on, man. There is this whole thing on Twitter, like people were in a fucking uproar because she wore that to like an auto, like a meet and greet, like an autograph thing. It was like, a, but this isn't for real though. This is a music video. No, I'm talking about for real. Oh, she really did that. But yeah, and people were outraged because I mean, you know, you could see that. Well, it turns out there is plastic inside of the mask. There is plastic okay. sewn in. Um, <laughs> she got really upset. The people got really upset with her because everybody thought that she was stupid. Um, but it was just, just seeing it all unfold on Twitter. Um, 
I mean, people were just saying some really awful things about her. It's like, and they were all fans. Like, it's amazing, like how fast, like they'll just dump culture. You. Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. Like people are looking, you know, like. I mean, just people are like, I love you, but this ain't it. Yeah, I'm not listening to you anymore. Like, just, it's like, what? It's like, give her a chance. Like, yeah, expe especially like if you weren't there, obviously. Yeah. And obviously they weren't, or they would have known. Right. Um, yeah, but yeah, Twitter's just drama, drama, drama all the time. Who all needs soap? Time. Who needs soap operas anymore, really? With social what? media, like, <laughs> like just, just get on there and you got it. It's like reality reality TV mixed with soap operas. I mean, it really is. Um, you don't have your speaker volume on, do you? I do not. Speaker volume. Okay. okay. I'm using this mic. Why? I thought I heard an echo earlier. I wasn't sure. Just wanted to double check. Okay. Okay. So we're going to. We're going to keep going. I, I'm loving the way this is filmed so far. Like, I like that, okay. that burn film transition they did and just like the the colors and just the whole vintage aesthetic. She's notorious for that. But yeah, the 50s done. vibe and that nice red Mercedes. And oh, look, yeah. Immediately started getting relaxed when uh, I was listening. That's why I, that's one of the reasons like I like Billy so much is like her voice just soothing yeah it's like a back massage but same experience here <laughs> yeah yeah i think that so far just everything about this video is done exceptionally well so let's continue <laughs> Real quick, wherever they but, are, I, I want to go. <laughs> I want to go to this, whatever, whatever dimension this is. Oh, just right. seems like just seems like they're all it's like you know i don't know not reality not right. living in reality but i still want to go to this dimension wherever well are. i know that, that this this realm or world or dimension that they're in i know it exists in somewhere in california i know that much it's in california it's in california <laughs> Is it as lighthearted and relaxing as being depicted in this video? Probably not. I doubt Probably it. But not. even with know. the chemtrails, you know, should be toxic. Right. <laughs> Maybe it is toxic. It's all front. They're all fake. Uh, to dream, though. Right. Right. All right. Made you for coffee at the elementary schools. We laugh about nothing as the summer gets cool. It's beautiful how the state normality settles down over me. On my body, her unhappy arms still so strange. Do you see that? I like, don't know she like on the on the on the damn car door, both aren't like driving. Wasn't she and drinking then, and driving? Well, that too, and then just standing <laughs> up like in the car, like who would the fuck had to stand uh, with? It's, it's gonna be all over Twitter. <laughs> it's gonna be. All 
Like, damn, uh, what? Well, there it's definitely depicting like just there she's not in reality. I don't know if she's like on well, she's obviously drunk. Um, but no, but this whole thing is just like it's a, it's almost like a dream, like she's having a dream. Do you know what I'm saying? It's just like That's... you know, when you have a when you have a dream and you just get like random bits and pieces of like your life just kind of like it makes sense, but it doesn't make sense. Yeah. Um, so but uh, yeah, I did. I did notice the the reckless driving, but that was so. crazy, crazy Lana. All right, let's keep going. Stop. Stop Okay, okay, I, I just, just thought of something. What if it's uh, the chemtrails, you know, is releasing what, you know, whatever toxin that's like going to their head. And that's why they're all like, you know, spacey and dreamlike and, you know, just not present with, within reality. Like maybe that's kind of what she's going for in the video is just they're just being polluted. I mean, that would totally make sense. Totally yeah. make sense. Sorry. Well, I, I, I 100%. I'll go with yeah. that. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man, the trip's getting bad now, though. What? It's those like empowered meme eyes. Damn, this got dark real fast. Okay, so some it's serious like, Wizard of Oz and like Fright Night vibes going on. Oh yeah, I did not expect it to go there at all. No, um, she. I mean, like we've talked about this in other reactions, but like the art that goes within the videos for some of these, um, you know, she's not only like you know a singer songwriter, which is an art in itself, but this this video is is i really really appreciate the aesthetic and all the artistic value that went into it and everything like that even like the little things like you can hear like the clinking of the glass and things like mm -hmm. that um just kind of complimenting the music yeah i just really appreciate it and visually now it's just super badass i really like it a lot got really yeah good. this is this is what i i love all the time i talk about i love a good cinematic music video like a real music video with like a storyline and great visuals and aesthetics and everything just like i love a high production and i mean i can appreciate low product low budget low production videos if they're done right um you know but videos like this that this is the type of shit I, I always used to get excited about when mtv first became a thing you know, that was like music videos. That's Me what I too. lived for. Me too. Me too. I mean, the 80s would not have been the 80s without music videos. And I feel like it's, I don't know, I somewhat feel like it's a lost art. It but, really, it does kind of feel like that sometimes. But this is definitely um, makes me happy that. Oh, yeah. Video here. Yeah, for sure. 
So, all right. That all that darkness just came out of nowhere. Yeah. I really have no idea what's going on at this point. Are are they having like a bad trip or is it supposed to be, or is it not supposed to make sense? I'm always trying to make sense out of these videos. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I feel you on that. Like this is one of those ones I would definitely have to go back and like watch again. I mean, I, I feel like it maybe it, it's, it's more than more than a trip. Cause I mean, there's like wolves and, but then again, there's like dead birds in a shower and walking through glass and so, fuck, I don't know. I know visually it's just like completely entrancing, but uh, story wise, well, like I think it's definitely possibly open to interpretation. The chemtrails and the country clubs raising your kids and supposedly like this prim and proper environment, um, but it's all fake and just ends up being toxic and and then, you know, it gets kind of dark, but I don't know. I kind of like the dark though, you know, the, you have the sexuality there at the end, you know, at the end with the, the women and stuff that's just a beautiful art and Oh yeah, it was like some in the walls, but but now she's like bleeding in the shower. So that's what threw me off. So like it got dark, and I was like, oh, this is aesthetically beautiful. I'm into this. Yes, I like this better than the country club, honestly. Um, but now it's kind of going to like a weird, almost like what's going on vibe. Why is she in the shower? Like, why is she ble why is she bleeding? Yeah, it, like it's gone. Like now, I feel like it's kind of moved into like a. David Lynch meets Darren Aronofsky oh, kind of yeah, weird yeah. hybrid of what the fuck. Yes. Kind of weird. And especially like with the colors and everything. Yeah. Um, yes. Yeah. Visually, this is really good. And weird. Weird. Yeah. Wow. Her face is so perfect. That was good, though. Okay. Closing out that screen record and saving that. Man, that video is fucking amazing. It was. The end, too. Like, I just... I can't, I, I can I, I mean, I, like I said, I, I'm, I'm always trying to figure these things out. Probably should keep my mouth shut because I'm going to have like a bunch of people in the comments being like, no, well, actually, you're wrong. <laughs> and I'm going to be like, I'm, I'm always wrong. But um, yeah, I really liked it a lot. Uh, I've definitely, I've come up with like theories for music videos before. And some of them, you know, of course, I was just being funny. And uh, because they were just so outlandish and, you know, people really thought I was being serious. And, uh, you know, then there was somewhere like I really thought I was onto something. And then it turns out I was like totally wrong. Um, and, you know, people will definitely let you know if they know more about it, they will let you know. And, you know, that's OK, because I like to learn. I, I don't mind. I do, too. I do, too. Like, I take I feel like I take criticism fairly well. Yeah, I mean, if people I've know, I've had cool years shit, of practice, so I'm really good at it now. 
<laughs> I, I like learning all the like weird little facts than like things that go into like productions that I normally wouldn't have like thought to like Google on my own or something, you know, it's like, well, I really appreciate you sharing that one with me. I liked it. That was good. I'm going to have to listen to more of her stuff. I almost, this is almost very, she's so classic too. Like I want to, I like want to buy the, I mean, I want to buy vinyl and listen to it and right. You know, sit back and have a drink and just, it's really good. So yeah, if you're new to the channel and you missed the beginning of this video, I think I might've said subscribe. Uh, it's the cool thing to do. Um, you know, cool people do that. They hit subscribe because they like to make other people who do videos feel good about themselves, which is what you would be doing. And it would help my channel grow and inspire me to keep making more videos. So thanks in advance. Just do it. It's free. Uh, also, I know I say this in every video, but there is cool merch available and it is inspired by like d death and being dead inside and depression i like it i like it thank you thank you very much it's um, witty and sexy yeah there you go there see that's a selling point right there uh mm -hmm. go check it out links in the description um you know you'll be helping helping out a a small time creator pay his bills bills um but yeah so uh just keep an eye out for the next video there's one coming soon follow me on the twitter look for nonsense i post stupid shit there uh it starts some drama with me i don't know uh but i'm, I'm gonna you know thanks again morgan for joining me uh thanks for having i'm glad me. glad you glad we got to watch the magnificence that is lana del rey love lana del rey she's fabulous I, I keep looking at her face. So, yeah, uh, until the next one. Get the Aussie to work.